Hello, this is Steve of Box Queens, and welcome back to my channel. I'm Steve, and today I've got two coins that represent probably the most or the best known part of one man's life. That one man is this gentleman here, Horatio Nelson, who, of course, was a famous mariner and Royal Naval officer. And he had an extremely uh, famous battle, the Battle of Trafalgar. Now, I didn't actually know for a long, long time where Trafalgar was, but it's off the off the coast of Spain, where they bumped into the rival navy coming out of port in Spain, and there was a huge battle, and it's just off a, a point called Trafalgar I believe or just off a town called Trafalgar. I have been I've bought both of these coins on eBay because they're from the year of commemorating uh, 200 years of the Battle of Trafalgar. Uh, Battle of Trafalgar being 1805 which means say these coins were issued in 2005. They did come as a twin pack but they also came as individual packs and this is the individual one for Nelson himself. There's a lot of information about Nelson and how he how he fared within the Navy. There's also stuff about Nelson's column and other uh, another um, paraphernalia with Nelson on it because there's a lot of collectors for Nelson stuff. Nelson memorabilia. And on the back you have the portrait of him without his arm, without his right uh, his right arm, which he lost of course in the battle prior to Trafalgar. There is a lot of information about this. On the back or on the obverse should I say of the coin. I'll need to bring you in at this point so just one second while I bring you in. There you go this is the obverse of the coin. It's a five pound coin dated 2005. It's not dated on this side it's dated on the other side. So you've got the portrait which I believe is the IRB chalk portrait so it's the fourth portrait of the Queen, the IRB portrait, and there's an actual history of Nelson. I've just seen it now. It's a history of Nelson in date, in date to order, of what he did and where he served. It goes down the whole of this, this right hand side of the panel. With the, where the Queen's obverse head is and this is the actual Nelson coin. It's a portrait of Nelson with his full name going across the top Horatio Nelson and it's got the dates 1805 to 2005 so it's a bicentennial of the Battle of Trafalgar where he died. So that's the coin, it's a very nice coin, it's a very straightforward portrait now Britain wasn't the only one that brought out commemorative uh, coins around about this date. I believe Jersey and Guernsey also did and I believe uh, the Isle of Man as well but don't quote me on the Isle of Man one but certainly the Channel Islands did. This is a nice bold portrait of Nelson as can be seen in his naval uniform and as he would have as you would have seen him in life. I've wanted this coin for a while. I've been doing just recently a hunt for five pound coins that I don't haven't yet got. And these were two that I had trawled up and I got them to present to you as a set. So this is the first one, this is a Nelson coin. The same year and as I said in some packaging they came as a dual pack. So that's a Nelson one and this is the Trafalgar coin. I'm just going to have to get it out of its plastic wallet for a second. On the front, 
You've got the five pound IRB, the portrait, the fourth portrait of the Queen, the IRB portrait. It's a five pound coin. And on the back, you have Nelson's ship. At least I think it's Nelson's ship. Yes, it is Nelson's ship. And it's got underneath it, underneath the ship that's on the waves, you've got Trafalgar written. And then you've got the date of 2005. Just making sure it's the right date there. There's 1805 on that on that side, on the left-hand side of the coin, and 2005 on the right-hand side of the coin. Now, 1805, of course, was the date of the battle, and 2005 is the year of this particular coin was minted. It's a companion piece to the Nelson one. The battle being, of course, on the 21st of October, 1805, or the main part of the battle. And that's Nelson's flagship. Now, as I said, these coins are known to be also available as a pair in the same uh, in the same presentation pack. However, I bought them as two separate ones. Tell me, what did you think of these coins? Let me just get you a portrait out. Just take it out a bit. Oh, come on. Wrong one. There we go. So, what do you think of these two coins? I thought, I think they're, uh, they're wonderful companion pieces and I'm very glad I got the pair of them and I could show you them off as companion pieces. I think I paid around about I think it's about £12 for that one and about £7 for that one. So, and I believe the ones that hold both of them in the same packages will go for around about £20 to £25, maybe a bit more. I'm very happy to have both of them. They were ones I needed for my collection. Down below, do you have these ones? Did you buy them both? Or are you looking to add them to your collection in the future? I'll be interested to find out. As I said, I've had a hunt for £5 coins that I was missing from the set. I will have more of these to bring to you over the next few weeks. And in the meantime, if you're having a hunt, I hope you have a successful one and you find the coins you're looking for. If you are doing what I'm doing, which is looking out for coins on the net and you're buying them, I hope you can buy them for the cost that you want to pay. If you've been here and you like this one, please give me the thumbs up because it helps me, helps me no end with YouTube. If you're a returner or if it's your first time and you're not subscribed to the channel, can you please do so? I would love to have you back for future coin videos that I do and take you on my journey through the coins. In the meantime, until we meet up again, bye bye for now. Ta-da!